Thailand has been on my list for a long time and I finally had the opportunity to visit. After spending my one year anniversary in the Maldives with Carl and a week exploring Sri Lanka with my mom, I finally hopped on a plane and flew from Sri Lanka to Thailand for a solo journey, starting with a speedboat ride from Phuket to the Phi Phi Islands. Got off our boat and we're taking another little boat to the island. I checked into Zibolo Resort, which won the world's best sustainable boutique hotel back in 2014. I'm so excited to be here. Thailand has literally been like a dream of mine for a while now. Um, so I'm super excited to be here. I actually found this hotel, this resort, Zivola, um, through a, a website called Green Pearls. So a lot of you guys know I've been on this quest for a while now to, you know, be a more responsible, eco-friendly traveler. And this website basically has a whole list of like sustainable, eco-friendly hotels. So it makes my search a lot easier. So that's how I found this place so super excited to be staying at like a fully vetted sustainable hotel um, for the next couple of days on the Fifi Islands. I am a very bad listener like when they gave me the tour of my room they told me to keep this closed to not let mosquitoes in and as you can see I have not been following their advice so I probably already let about 50 mosquitoes in and as you can see I'm messy AF how I roll. <laughs> it was really pretty when I first walked in though. <laughs> I think my dad had one of these when I was a kid. It basically zaps mosquitoes. All right, super cute. Look at the little sink. I love this. It's nice. And of course, my favorite, the outdoor shower. You guys know I love outdoor showers. Yes. Yes, outdoor shower for the win. Super excited about this. All right, and there you have it. That's a tour of my little beach view villa, I guess you would call it. Yeah, beach view villa. Maybe I'm making that up. It's really cute though. I'm gonna hop in that outdoor shower and freshen up because I've been on the plane <sighs> and in airports for like the past day and as you can see I still didn't close this so I just I really hope I don't get bit up tonight after showering I spent the rest of the evening relaxing I got a massage and toured their jungle villa suite which is hands down where I'd stay next time when I bring Carl with me it's super private and those rainforest views are awesome the next day was all about exploring. I did the Maya Adventure Tour where I was able to really get a feel of the beauty of the nearby lagoons and uninhabited islands. All right, so we are disembarking. We are officially in Maya Bay. I've seen many pictures of this place, so now I'm here. Okay, so just a quick tip. If you wanna come here, make sure you get here super early because it gets really crowded the later you get here. So we actually got here around 8.30, which was a pretty good time. I actually was able to take a picture without people in the background. My hair is like bananas right now. I don't know what's going on. But we're about to go snorkeling, so I'm actually gonna switch to the GoPro. Although my time here was short, it was nice to know there are places in Thailand that make sustainability a priority. Some of Zivola's sustainable practices include heavily investing in energy conservation, sourcing and treating water from local wells and rainwater, which they then use to water their jungle garden, compost production, nature conservation and daily cleanups, coral reef protection initiatives, first aid assistance for birds, extensive recycling, 
and supporting the local community. So if you ever plan to visit the PP Islands in Thailand, be sure to support this green hotel. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And for more sustainable travel and lifestyle videos, hit that subscribe button.